Get ready to... Ooh, boy. Get ready. Now you got to learn your buttons. Accelerate, decelerate, recenter, pitch. Oh, I need the other controller. It's... Uh, I'm going to guide you. There you go. Damn it. You, I could have had some fun with this. Let's begin. All right. Can you actually fail this? Uh, yes, you can. Yeah. Okay. Does it turn into Apollo 13? <laughs> yeah. <laughs> actually, no. That wasn't the one that blew up. Uh, Which one was it? No, Apollo 13 was the one where they slingshotted around the backside of the moon and came back towards right. Earth. Yeah. Uh, now i got to get my phone out again. I should have brought my laptop to just do these searches way faster. Oh. That's not the moon, unless I've been lied to. No, that's Canada. Mexico. There's the United States. Stop. No. Canada. Oh. I mean, you're supposed to be controlling it, why aren't you? I'm in, in there, I think. So okay, there we go. Yep. So oh, check this man. out. So see that little eye thing? Yeah, through? That's, it's like a little thing they have in jets now. That's what you use to target. Yeah. I would not trust myself if I had to do that. I have a hard enough time believing I can actually drive one of those uh, giant Mack trucks around, 18 wheelers, and okay. backing up and shit like that. I couldn't do this. I couldn't even. I would not be able to trust myself with this. Oh yeah. I'm like, I don't know. I'm just gonna so, will um, myself whoop, into crashing. I'm flipping the thing around. Yeah, you gotta connect to the bottom of the lunar lander. Uh, list of. Failed moon form space missions. Here we go. Uh, I think I got, well, there's a lot here. They're also taking into a town. All taking into a town. I can talk. All the uh, oh yeah, team uh, Russian and other ones. You're not lined up. You got to be with that black hole, right? Or is it a thing off to the side? No, it's this green thing right here. Okay. The the black hole is a. Uh, Black hole, son. That, that's. I think that. I don't know what that is. Hey, you bum! Get a job. Um. What Apollo missions failed? No, oh, they're talking about the man ones. Apollo five. Oh, wait, here we go. List of Apollo missions. You gotta like look through this with one eye. Yeah, you gotta do the wink thing. Otherwise, yeah, you do. <laughs> it, it's it's the. Uh, like aiming down sights, if you try to keep both eyes open, you're just gonna fuck yourself. I'm trying to aim. And you're lined up pretty easy. Hit the thrusters, max right into it, ram it. No, I'm still heading towards it. Yeah, with some authority. Oh, <laughs> you're off, you're off kilter. I got it. It's so intense. Yeah, I think I slowed down too much. So one meter. One meter. Oh, he's actually talking to you while you're doing it? Yeah, yeah. Well, one meter is only three feet. Yeah, very close. I wonder how they actually planned this out. Like I they know where, for where, where, for, where they know. Why can't I fucking talk? They know where to aim and how to simulate all this stuff back in the '60s. That's amazing. Man, I'm gonna find. Oh, I don't want to read all this. Just give me a list, people. And catch it. there we go. I'm in. Let's try here. We good. Hey, you did that part. Now what? Are you pregnant? Are you gonna have space babies now? No, no it's time to blow this popsicle stand. We'll go to the moon. Mike is just barely readable. That was Neil. How are you reading, Mike? Loud and clear now, Mike. Shut up, Mike. You're not the cool one. It's those other two. One of them just died. That was Buzz, right? Mm. Yeah, Buzz just I died, I believe, and Neil really? died. No, I think Buzz. Get my still phone out <laughs> again. <laughs> oh, here we go. Apollo 11, this is Houston. Oh. Yeah, those little actuators. Uh, to search this again. Buzz. Aldrin. It's either Buzz just died or Neil just died. I want to say Buzz is still alive and Neil is dead. That's a real grumpy picture of him. I'm going to find out. Uh, wait. Ooh. Well, that's a picture of him with Trump, so yeah, he's still alive. Overall score. Yeah. Hey. And his latest tweet says, hey, that's my hat. Yeah, so Buzz is still alive. Okay, yeah. That's what I thought. 
Mission Maybe time elapsed. Four days, four hours, ten minutes. It took six days to get to the, to the uh, moon, I believe. Really? And it's either three or six months to get to Mars. Wow. Or maybe that's years. No, no. I I think I want to say no more than there and back, no more than two years. Well, I wanna say. I'm going to stop putting my phone in my pocket so I can find this stuff out. Yeah. Just leave it Time on your lap. to... Wait, let's take. Let's see where this to thing is. Travel to Mars. Do you see the thing anywhere? What thing am I looking for? The 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 sun or the Earth? Oh, there it is. Earth. Oh, the thing back there. Okay. You 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 I'm hurt. Like cranking my neck. <laughs> but that's not what you're landing for, though, is it? No, no. You're going for the moon. Yeah. Which is the sun. I think this what is, is that the moon. giant? What's that giant line going through there? Is that the actual moon? I think that's the moon. Moon's flat too. We're breaking, breaking so many, all the news here. Um, oh, there it is. How long does it take? No, it's nine months. In the nine months it takes to get to Mars. Okay. After spending nine months on your way to Mars, you'll probably want to spend more time there. In fact, you must because okay, so it is nine months. Nine months. Okay. Nine months of sitting in a fridge. And I know ship. there's uh, only a certain time wh- where you, where you can, you know, where all the uh, that's, planets are that's, aligned. No, that's the real cool thing about uh, space. Yeah, it's real easy to calculate. Yeah, it is. Yeah, it's, it's so super magic. predictable. All this stuff, except for the one time you don't convert from uh, the metric system and you crash your million dollar project. Because I believe that? the Chinese, I believe, did that. It, it happened in the late 90s, I believe. Someone forgot to convert. Oh, wow. And it either expected the planet's surface to be like three miles farther than it actually was. So it just fucking plummeted at full speed right into the surface Jesus. of... I think it was Mars. Wow. <clears throat> yeah, that was a that was a snap move. I think that's gold sheet they put on the outside of that thing. They like putting gold like sheets on everything when they go out in space. Do you know why they put that stuff? Uh, it's, uh, no, no. Well, you got your phone. <laughs> Hopefully, you didn't put it away. Well, I always do. Well, let's just keep searching. Why do they put gold? On the I mean, well, the satellite will lunar to land, to lander or whatever it's called. Uh, Roger, let us know when you're ready I think to it has to do with pad, the, and a PDI pad, over. maybe it's cheap. It's easy to do. Maybe it's not gold. Maybe it's it's says we're going. some um, kind of foil. Coming up on five Someone stole. I don't care about the replica. Why was gold cover foil on the lunar landing equipment? Here we go. So we'll see how well I do on this landing because Spa- the space so they do not gather heat. Ah, uh, okay. Okay. That makes sense. I guess. Yeah, because there's going to be a lot of heat underneath that when it's taken off from the moon. That's the thing I heard about space, though, is if you were actually drifting out in space, it wouldn't be cold. No, 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 I know, but I'm talking about... You nailed the mic <laughs> real hard. No, what they say is, is since there's no... Uh, nothing out in space, is a giant vacuum, right. all the moisture that's on your arms yeah. evaporates. Really? It causes a little bit of a heat pocket above your extremities. So I, I guess it actually feels warm, but I think at a certain point that goes away and then you just... Uh, all your blood vessels rupture, at least in your eyeballs, and you lose those after a while. Yeah, and then... You- you just suffocate, right? Someone did the math, and I think it's... Oh, this is real. Is that a face twirling around? No, it's the... Yeah, but it looks like... Okay, oh. here we go. So, pitch forward, pitch backwards. Toggle landing site marker. Okay. Recenter. That, what, which... It's whatever that button is. <laughs> That's why. Okay. Okay, here we yep, go. You Breaking. Got it. It's all angular. Visibility... Landing. You never played Moon Lander, did you? Or was it Rocket something or other? Where it was one of really early arcade game where you just landed a rocket and you had to do it a certain way. If you did it too fast, it would explode. No, I don't remember that. Hmm. You may have not ever played it. Yeah, it's possible. 
Hey, look, it's another line of dialogue. I don't know who said this. Maybe it was Tom Jones. And then right after this, he went into... I was close. Kepler. Letter to Galileo. 1610. Can you do the Fandango? You know what I heard about Thunderbolts? What? They're lightning. (laughs) You know what happens when you see one of those? Death. It can be very, very frightening. And if you're frightened, you know what you... If you're frightened, you know what you can probably yell Uh, is Galileo. There it is. I gotta land right there. Because I'm just a poor boy. Nobody loves me. And he is just a poor boy from a poor family. I need a break. Trying to land a moon thing on the moon. Just hit a board. So I want to go home. Is there anybody else in the thing there with you? I, what, what, so what are you lining up here to 50? I have no idea. <laughs> you haven't done this part yet? Uh, I attempted it, but... Oh, you crashed? I flew over it. Oh. So, so I got to get the angle in, you know? So I'm yeah, you got to angle on that. And then I'm using the thruster to... Kill your descent and then steadily slow, verticalize slow yourself. Down, yeah, or yeah. Make yourself perpendicular to the surface of the moon. I'm kind of dropping. Yeah, you're going to be way... Oh, shit. I got alarms going. Oh, wait, that's master master alarm. It's probably saying, pull up. Whoop, whoop. Uh, I, pull I, up. I did too much braking. <laughs> Flew out of range. Right. You are no... Let's Spaceman try. Evo. It, dude, this is not You're never easy. who that guy I just said was who was from your country. Ah, shit. No, no you hit the wrong button? I think I did. Well, maybe you can hit pause and then re... You know no, what? Here you go. Now you can do it. You get one more chance. I, uh, the computer's doing this. Uh, you, should just That's pretend, all right. you should have just pretended you were doing it because no one would be able to yeah. say you weren't. It's all right. You are no spaceman. This is, yeah, it would have been helpful if they actually gave you... Oh, there is another guy in here. Yeah. Where's the third guy, though? He's orbiting. No, you're... Oh, that's right. There's uh, Neil look and how, Buzz, look, I think. look how quickly we forgot about Michael. <laughs> yeah. Look at They were standing. Well, they're kind of floating, probably. There's no seats. He looks like his feet... Either it's not really good... Uh, um, rendering, whatever you want to call it, but maybe he's floating and he's not really sitting because there's no gravity. It's minuscule at best. So maybe it actually is pulling him down to the surface. What's the 1201 alarm? Uh, maybe uh, out of range. Can you grab anything? You you can't grab. It's not one of these ones. So I'm going to stop saying grab stuff. I don't think that's how it works. Man, that must have been freaking incredible. Right doing what these dudes are doing? Yeah. I can't believe I called them dudes. <laughs> men. They're men. They're men in suits. Very good. Flying the moon. They don't have a spoon. Like, look at the... It's all analog. I mean, well, it's there's six, some digital. It's, it's the 60s, man. That right there, that's digital. That's di- digital. Well, kind of. It's just... That's just a LED s- yeah. display, so maybe it's not digital. But everything we got, we got from NASA as far as tex- techno- technology goes, so maybe this oh, is... Oh, for sure. I think Velcro is a big one, right? Velcro... Um, I can't think of any other examples except Velcro because you just mentioned it. Maybe Velcro is. Yeah, that's a big one. Okay. Pretty sure. They got moon rocks for us. Moon rocks. <laughs> it's apparently the most expensive thing you can find on Earth if you're trying to buy it. Really? Buying it's the most because ex- it's impossible to get. Yeah, it's There's very hard a to finite get. resource, and it's all the stuff we brought back in handfuls. And I believe when they actually did uh, look at it under a microscope, it was all super spiky coarse Mm -hmm. like um if you took like rocks from earth and compared them that the earth rocks are way more are are far more smooth and then moon rocks are way more jagged and sharp interesting it has to do something with atmosphere and it being the cold dead recess of space gotcha and they if you look it's been pelted with asteroids so i don't think that helps it either i mean yeah look, look at this 
It did have an atmosphere a very, very long time ago, but it was super thin, and I believe they say that it was visible from Earth at the time. Huh. Yeah, it was, uh, what was it? Earth and the moon, when the planet was there's, developing. There, I think what there's, what, what the general consensus, consensus is now a giant asteroid hit the Earth when it was forming, and a huge chunk of Earth actually blew off and formed the moon. Okay. There may I, be other also. I heard that theories that yeah, it like be, you know, the moon was its own little thing that was developing, and then got caught in the gravity and, of and the Earth. Earth, and well, back then it wasn't Earth, but it collided with. They collided together. Yeah, well, I'll find. Oh, let's find out. Apparently, like you can find. I don't know. You can find. I'll look. I'll look right now. All right. I think I there's could a be bunch of completely pulling this out. Yeah, of my ass. it's. There's no definitive, I don't think, but there's also prevailing ideas, and one of them is because the moon was formed about four and a half billion years ago uh, out of debris thrown into orbit by a massive collision between a small proto Earth and another planet, planetoid about the size of Mars. That's it, brother. So some shit we smashing some other shit. Landed on the moon. All right, get out. I gotta piss. <laughs> I call dibs in that crater. That's my house. <laughs> Take a big dump there. <laughs> <laughs> Wonder if you actually could quickly take a dump and not kill yourself. There's, a, there's exposure. Like there's a certain amount of seconds you could live out in space. And to be the guy that said I took a dump on the moon, my poop is there. I bet you maybe they no they recycle a lot of shit. 